All right, YouTube Big Germs Garage. Um, I'm looking at another project four wheeler I just picked up. Um, this one, based on the uh, the VIN number, it's a 1998 Polaris Trail Boss 250. It is two wheel drive. Um, it's missing a bunch of stuff, but uh, not too bad. It does have the front plastic here. Um, missing the cover for the tank. Missing the pull start there. Uh, missing the carburetor, airbox. The 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 cool thing about it is that the tires are holding air, um, and the guy I got it from said he hasn't put air in them in a while. So, and I bought it two nights ago. It's been sitting in my truck since then. Um, so, yeah, if you look at this side, it is missing the uh, the clutches are off. There's a primary clutch. There's a secondary clutch, um, and it's missing the cover. Um, he said he took the starter off of it, so you can see the, the, the red wire down there for the starter. Um, the transmission turns over, um, turns, it's not stuck or anything. The motor turns over as well um, by hand. It's a little tough to move, but it will spin. Uh, so I don't know if it's a combination of rust or just trying to turn that by hand. Um, I got it to turn more the other day when I tried with two hands. But yeah, it's a, uh, I got the key for it. The key's missing right there, but it's in the house. Um, the, uh, the front, the handle brake doesn't have any tension to it. I'm sure the back brake doesn't do much either. But not too bad. Um, the ad was for a hundred bucks for best offer and I got it for 70 so pretty good deal um, if you remember a couple weeks ago I made a video one of the last video I really posted was of a uh, an older Trail Boss 250 and a Trail Blazer 250 um, that I got those for 300 bucks and the Trail Boss needed a transmission supposedly their motor ran and the trailblazer thing had motor issues um but if you know maybe you can comment and, and help me out i had the i've been yesterday i was sick with the stomach flu all day so i haven't had time to come out here and i'm not really feeling it too much today but i wanted to come get this out of my truck um if you know if this trail boss 250 transmission will fit in a, this is 98 um it will fit into like a uh, 1988 trail boss 250 let me know. I don't know if they're the same or different. Or I know a lot of these full wheelers, the Polaris Trailblazers, and a lot of the stuff's the same from year to year. Um, they just might switch a couple little things. But if you know right offhand, if not, I can figure it out just by looking or going online. Just haven't had a chance to do it yet. But anyway, I just wanted to show you my newest uh, newest find. Um, it's kind of funny. It wasn't off of Craig's list. It was off one of those Facebook sites where uh people sell stuff a yard sale site and i saw it one day in the background of another ad for a zero turn mower i was tempted to email the guy and find out if the full wheeler was for sale as well but i didn't do it with christmas and stuff just busy and a couple days later i saw this listed for 100 bucks thought about it and then like i guess it busy with christmas and everything and then finally like a week almost a week later i ended up going and getting it because nobody else wanted it for some reason um, i thought for sure it would have been gone pretty quick but surprise it, it was still there but 1998 Polaris Trail Boss 250 um, it's got the hitch exhaust I mean for the most part it's still mostly complete but alright thanks for watching Big Drums Garage and I'll catch you next time